In the previous video, we had given you the introduction of Chapter 3, in this video we will talk about the first topic of this chapter, graphical representation of linear equation. If you haven't seen the introduction video of the chapter yet, then you will get the link of that video in the i button and in the video's description. Suppose we are given two lines on the graph. Only one of the possibilities given below will appear there. Either those two lines will intersect each other at some point. Or will those two lines be parallel to each other? Another possibility can be made that both the lines will be coincident. Let us try to understand it through an example. Romila buys two pencils and three erasers for nine rupees from a stationery shop. Her friend Sonali also buys four pencils and six erasers for 18 rupees from there. We have to show these two situations on the graph. Let's solve this. Let us assume the cost of one pencil to be x rupees. And the cost of one eraser is y rupees. Then our linear equations will be something like this. The first equation would be 2x plus 3y equals 9. Here 2 pencils plus 3 erasers and their value is 9. The second equation will be 4x plus 6y equals 18. Here 4 pencils plus 6 erasers and their value is 18. We have already figured out two solutions of both the equations which you can see in the table. Now we have to draw these solutions on the graph. First we will plot the solutions of first case on the graph. x0 and y3, x4.5 and y0. Now let us plot the solutions of the second equation on the graph. x0 and y3, x3 and y1. After plotting all the solutions on the graph, now we will draw the line of both the equations. Here you will be able to see that there is only one line on the graph. This is because both the equations are equal. We will call this situation that both the lines are coincide, And that was our third possibility. Let us try to understand it better through another example. Here two trains are represented by two equations. Let us see how to display these situations graphically. Just like in the previous example, we have found two solutions of both the equations here, which you can see in the table. Let us plot all these solutions on the graph. First of all we will plot the solution of first equation on the graph. x0 and y2. x4 and y0. Now let's draw the line of this equation. Now let us plot the solutions of second equation. x0 and y3. x6 and y0. Now let us also draw the line of this equation on the graph. Here you will be able to see that both the lines are parallel to each other. And this justifies our second possibility. In this video we learned how to plot two linear equations on the graph. In the next video we will try to know how to solve two linear equations graphically. Till then take care and don't forget to like and share the video. Thanks for watching the video.